the moment, there's nothing in the NeoFly guide for version 4 that walks you through the steps to get a qualifying test set up, how to move your pilot, how to switch aircraft, and how to start it. This is creating a lot of confusion and a lot of frustration, especially when you get charged your hard-earned game money every time you try to initiate a test and fail to launch it. Let's clarify things right now so you don't waste a ton of game money like I did. Picking the test you want is pretty straightforward. Find the qualifying test you want and select the activate icon. This is where everyone's getting confused. The text states to move your pilot to the designated airport and then assign your pilot to the test plane in the hangar. And that when you uh, start it, it should automatically start the test. What it doesn't say is that you need to relocate your pilot in the NeoFly app on the pilot screen first and also relocate your pilot and set up your aircraft from the main menu of the flight simulator. If you just do it in the sim, you'll not be able to assign your pilot to the test aircraft. So what you'll get in the hangar if you only use the main menu is this. Your aircraft and the test aircraft are displayed, but there's no way to assign yourself to it. Okay, so go into the pilot's menu again and select the locate button. Type in the required ICAO for the four letter ID for an airport or airstrip for your test and then click the check. Heads up, you will get charged a hefty game money fee for this. Once this is done, in the hangar, you can now assign yourself to the test aircraft. With that done, now you can relocate to the same ICAO and choose your test aircraft from the main menu of the simulator. Once you spawn into the testing location, Elena, the dispatcher, will automatically start your test. I hope this helped. If it did, I could really use some likes and new subscribers. Wink, wink. Good luck with your testing and your NeoFly careers, Captain.